Today, I'm going to be showing you one of the easiest and best ways, I think, beginners and pros, if they want to, can you uh, make liveries. So this is a really simple free website um, that I use for some stuff as well, like thumbnails uh, sometimes. Um, and it's really, really good. You can use it for lots of different things. But today, I'll be showing you how to do it with the liveries. Now, first of all, you want to head over to the PRC Discord and get the livery templates. If you don't know how to do that, make sure to head over and watch my livery tutorial that was posted earlier this week as a posting. Um, so you can go and watch that. I'll be available on my channel anyway. Um, and you can just watch that. It will show you how to get the templates. Get the templates for the vehicle you want. And then I'll be showing you how you can use this website to design it. And how I'm going to be using it for future series as well. So let's head over there now. So today we're going to be using Canva, which is an absolutely amazing website. You can make so much on it. As you can probably see, uh, just there, there is so much different uh, things you can create. But today, obviously, we're going to make liveries. I'll link it down below. Make your free account today. You can buy the pro version if you want access to more things. But the free one is perfectly fine. That's what I use, and I do a lot of things on here. So for today's purpose, I am just going to switch this back to recording so you can't exactly see all my files while I upload uh, my uh, template. But all you want to do is, like I've done, upload the template, use in new design, the custom size, create new design, leave it at the heights because it will auto do it so it fits the design of this. And there you go, it will upload it in your little toolbar over there. And that's all my tools are uh, interesting. Then you've got access to this design, which shows you some different designs that you might want to put there. Obviously, you don't want to do that because it will cover the whole thing. But yep, you've got elements, which is where you can search for different things. Say you wanted to put subscribe on the side, which you should all do. You can search it in there, find the element you want and put it on, you know. Uh, you've got brand hub, which is where you pick all your colours. Apps, which is different things that are available in Canva. This is where you can draw on it, look. You with all your different pens, erase it. You've got highlighters, all sorts of stuff like that. In here, you've got your text and the different fonts and different text boxes. And here, you've got all the stuff you upload. So, as you can see, I'm going to get started straight away. I'm going to make a rough livery, show you how easy it is. So, for text, I'm just going to grab a blank normal text box. And I'm going to make this uh, the a mayor, a mayor's vehicle. Mayor of River City. If you want to type that up, you go in here, look, you can pick the font that you want to use. I'm going to be using this font for today. Looks very, very jazzy. And I am not a professional livery creator, so my designers, please don't kill me for how bad this is going to look. Um, yeah, just pretend, pretend that I've not made this. Uh, we're going to shrink this down there, probably put it on the back door over here, there we go. That's brilliant, just going to plonk that there. We'll have a look, see if they've got anything for mayors. It didn't, didn't exactly spell it right. But my designers watching right now are going to kill me. I'm going to get so many DMs from them about how bad this is. So for this, half of them are premium. You will find that as you start to search more obs obscure things. But you can kind of go for something basic. We can have, say, that there. You can design whatever you want on it. So we'll have that for now. We can also add some effects to the text. So for the, in this case, I'm just going to add like a... Uh, maybe not an outline. Yeah, maybe not an outline. I don't know. I'll think about it later. We'll also not do that. I'll make sure to cover that up when I edit. Uh, what should we do back here? We'll have like a... If you do upload the back, obviously you can put stay back on it. So this is really, really good, I think, for creating your first livery. There's so many options, there's so many things you can do, and it doesn't require a really, really high skill level either, you know? Um, pretty simple, if I'm honest with you. Uh, and I think most people can get the hang of it really, really quick. So, you know, there's even frames if you want to get something in a certain frame to make it go a certain shape that's cool i suppose do it um i'm just gonna find some uh thing in here that i can add uh to the frame to show you, give you a good example there you go my logo that would be good there you go put that in that frame there it gives you a nice shape say i wanted to put that up back there lovely mayor of river city is me so i'll put that back there there we go that is my livery 
Then what you want to do when you've done it, you go file, download. It will download into obviously your file explorer. Once it is downloaded into there, you just want to upload it to Roblox. Um, and then once it's uploaded to Roblox, wait for it to get accepted. In the URL, you can grab its ID and upload it to ERLC. Um, it's basically the same concept as my custom livery tutorial because, yeah, it's the same concept as that because that you're basically doing the same thing. I uh, just get in the ID. Um, so yeah, if you if you have any designers you want to talk to, ask them what they use. You know, they might use this. I know some of mine do. Uh, some of mine obviously do have an access to much more advanced technology. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions about the software as well, I'll be happy to help. And also, one of my designers, Life, I know uses this software a lot. So um, hopefully, if Life's watching, if you if he can help us with the comments as well. Um, shout out to all my designers since we are doing a designs video. We've got Life. Uh, we've uh, we've got um, uh, Matt Trooper Matt, um, big really good designer. Life does a lot of like the merch for me, liveries. Matt does thumbnails and liveries. Then we also have uh, Lost Motive, who does a lot of like the staff liveries from my server. So shout out to all of them, and also yeah, um, let me know what you think of this software, what software you use, etc. Love to hear from you all. Make sure to send me your creations that you've made on Canva. I uh, hope they upload really well. Uh, check out some more of my videos, join my Discord server, like and subscribe, check out the rest of the links, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!